Uh, live in Star Wars universe or live in Star Trek universe? Star Wars, hands down. I got two lightsabers in my closet. Hey everybody, Doreen here, and today we're gonna be doing Would You Rather. Um, now this is something I did a little while ago, and I know people still do it on YouTube every once in a while, so um, I thought, why the hell not? Let's jump in here now that I, I got a little bit more of a setup and see how it goes. So, let's get started. Would you rather have grown up without a father? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Zero to 100 real quick or have grown up with that out of mother. Holy f okay um, I want to say mother. I want to say father. I'm gonna say I would rather have grown up without a father yeah, dad If you're watching this right now, I love you. I do. It's not like uh, I wish You know, I didn't grow up with you. I'm happy that I did. It's just uh, You gotta have that maternal presence, you know, like you can you can grow up without a father people do it all the time but um, not too many people do well as children without a mother you know drink milk for the rest of your life drink orange juice for the rest of your life uh, I'm gonna go with milk hands down I'm gonna go with milk 47% agree really that many people like orange juice Wow okay my reasoning is milk is delicious and orange juice sucks ass <laughs> But no, really, because you can like make like milkshakes. Fuck yeah. You can make uh, chocolate milk. You can have cereal. You can have a whole world of milk product. And, you, and what do you got? Orange juice? God forbid you try to drink some after brushing your teeth. Would you rather clean a room covered in blood? Clean a room filled with poo. Why is this even a question? Blood. Yeah, 90% blood. Who are the 10%? Who are these 100 thousand people who would clean a room filled with poo over blood i don't know if you're out there if you chose poo on this post a comment down below why so i can criticize you <laughs> no, i'm just fucking i'm genuinely genuinely curious though like who would choose to, to clean poo who would choose that would you rather eat nothing for two days eat the same meal for a month eat nothing for two days I, I do that on a regular basis not on purpose but on accident I get so caught up with work and YouTube and I mean I haven't ate in I don't know why I'm looking at a watch it doesn't have a date I haven't ate since yesterday at 3 and so about 24 hours almost and I haven't even felt it yet I have a problem would you rather pick the helix fossil praise helix I feel like most of that is because of praise helix be naked in front of your whole family for three hours Run through downtown naked for five minutes. One's gonna get me in jail, one's not. So, really, naked for five minutes. I mean, they should have included the clause that you wouldn't go to prison for indecent exposure. Otherwise, I would have picked it. But see, my brain, I'm smart. I know I would be down that street in two minutes. Maybe some cops go toe to toe with Michael Myers. Try to take down Freddy Krueger. So it's really, would you rather fight Michael Myers or Freddy Krueger? Freddy Krueger. Because he attacks you in your nightmares, and if you can learn to lucid dream, you can fight him back and kill that motherfucker. Would you rather prevent World War II? Holy shit. Win a life-changing amount of money in a lottery. Win a life-changing amount of money in a lottery. Not because I'm selfish. Because World War II has to happen for our reality to exist. I know what fucking with timelines does. If you died... I just spat a little, sorry. If you died, would you rather have your brain transplanted into a robot, transplanted into a robot, holy shit, or have your brain transplanted into the opposite sex, robot? Why would, why would 58% 58 of you pick opposite sex, you perverts? It's a fucking robot. You would be a robot with a brain. You could do anything, anything, anything. Would you rather? Find a book about everything about the past. Find a book about everything about the future. This could be very, very depressing. And this could answer so many questions. Find a book about everything in the past. Find a book about everything in the future. I went with future, not so I could know things, because it's better not to know the future, but because if I know everything about the future, now I can make the future sooner. I would know things about like space travel, unless it's a very post-apocalyptic depressing future, in which case it'd be nice to know that's the case because then I'll just do whatever the fuck I want in this time. 
but imagine if you had like, spacecrafts and like um, people had learned to you know use wormholes and there was colonies on other planets and all this advanced science and I knew all about that I could make that happen now Fuck, crazy live in Hyrule Hyrule I'm not even gonna read the other answer I think it was mushroom kingdom fuck mushroom fuck you fuck you and your 57% fucking Hyrule god damn it in the event of a zombie apocalypse would you rather team up with Walter White of Breaking Bad team up with Jesse Jax Teller, the Sons of the Anarchy. Okay, okay. Here's the thing. Walter's cool and all, but Jesse will fuck someone up. If some dudes come up to your squad and try to fuck with you, Jax is gonna fuck them up. What? What? Maybe it's just because not enough people watch Sons of Anarchy, but Jax would fuck everyone up. He is so fucking hardcore. Jesus. Would you rather be able to run 40 miles per hour, own a car? Well, I do own a car. Oh, you're just talking in general, though. Uh, be able to run 40 miles per hour, but I'd have to run anywhere, own a car. Really? There's no benefit to running 40 miles per hour. Like, what's the benefit of being able to run 40 miles per hour? You still have to run everywhere. And on top of that, you're not that fast. You go 40 miles per hour. If you wanted to go to California, it would probably take you, like, 14 hours of running now if it feels like move as fast as the flash or own a car. Yeah, okay, but that's not the fucking question uh, Would you rather be the parent of Hitler or the parent of Osama bin Laden? Osama Really, maybe it's just cuz it's like a recent thing You know Osama bin Laden's still like a sore subject for us and Hitler's like oh that was 80 years ago Who cares that he you know threw Jews in ovens and turned them into soap? That's not a big deal anymore, apparently. What the fuck is wrong with people? It's Hitler. It's the fucking Hitler. What did Obama, Osama bin Laden do? He created like a terrorist organization. Yeah, that's fucked up. 9-11. Uh, yeah, that's really fucked up. But like, he fucking took over Europe, enslaved an entire race, and committed mass genocide. Just cuz. Just cuz he didn't like them. Man, fucked up, y'all. Would you rather eat a rancid mixture of rotten egg and old fish or bathe naked and vomit? What the fuck is this question? Rancid mixture of rotten egg and old fish? Bathe naked and vomit? <sighs> bathe naked. <laughs> I don't want to taste that. I'd rather just feel it and smell it and be like, ugh, but I, uh, uh. All right, last one. Would you rather fight a hundred third graders at one time or fight 50 third graders at the same time? I have a story for you guys before I answer this question. So my first job when I was 18, well, I was the little cow at Chick-fil-A. Not just the cow at Chick-fil-A because I couldn't fit into the cow suit because I was too short. Uh, so I was the little cow with the propeller. Well, one day, Pop Warner kids were, you know, eating, and I went into the play area to kind of just dance around, do whatever you fucking do when you're pretending to be Cal Barney, and they started beating the shit out of me. It was like Children of the Corn. One of them blocked off the door. I'm not even fucking with you in this story. One of them blocked off the door. One jumped off the slide onto my head took me to the ground, they started trying to rip off my helmet, beating me up, there was probably like 20 of them. And uh, it took like two full grown men to pull me out. And as much as I wanted to just smack them around because they were fucking beating me up, the thought of a YouTube video, even though now it'd be fucking hilarious, but a YouTube video being out there of the Chick-fil-A cow slapping around some fucking children, I probably would have gone to jail, but. Um, so this, this question, it's home. I'm gonna go and fight 100 third graders one at a time um, because I already know how difficult it would be to fight 50 third graders at the same time. So I'm gonna go with that one. All right, cool. Yeah, everyone agrees. Or at least 76% of you. All right, well, that's gonna wrap it up for this episode. Um, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And other than that, I hope you all have a wonderful day and I'll catch you all in my next video. Later.